Hey guys, Chris here. Um, back with some more gameplay footage. This one's a game I'm quite excited to play. Um, it is a game I don't think is technically available in Europe, but I want to one match download it onto the um, Microsoft One console, so it's code across to the Series X. Um, it's Fantasy Star Online too. Um, love the original Fantasy Star Online on Dreamcast. Played a lot of time on that, even though I wasn't particularly good at it. Um, I've been hearing good things about Fantasy Star Online too. So yeah, if you want to give it a go? Oh. I kind of missed the Sonic Team logo that used to come up after Sega for Fantasy Star. Yeah, I do want to go through character creation stuff like that. I have played it briefly. Um, yeah, I have played it briefly, but I do want to. Um, yeah, it's a start game. Yeah. Okay. There's character creation. It seems to be frozen a bit. Create new character. Cool. Oracle. A giant fleet on an interplanetary voyage. Its inception made deep space travel possible, ushering in a new chapter in history. Now our sphere of activity spans across multiple galaxies. Thus did Oracle form a force to explore the unknown planets it discovers along the way. This force, Arts, explores and surveys alien planets. It's going to be a start for the game. The four species that belong to Oracle. Humans, natural all-rounders. Numans, photon manipulators. Casts, sturdy mechanical beings. Dumans, martial masters. Here in Arts, each species covers for the other's shortcomings and works together. Let's go through the different character um, types. Looks like we've arrived. We're approaching the planet Nevarius. It's uncivilized, with aggressive wildlife. It is great, this game. Stay sharp. Good luck out there. Thank you. Greetings, Ox recruits. You have done well. You now stand poised to take your first steps into the vast frontier of space. Here we go. Prepare to face the challenge of the unknown. Enter your personal path. Then, from all of us, welcome aboard. Okay. Let's choose what kind of cat I want. Go for Newman. I do like the Newmans. Uh, class type Hunter is close range, Ranger is far, Force is magic, Summoner is. That was bad, that was pretty cool. Bounce, um, aerial stuff. Braver. Good and close and long range. He's got a bow as well. Um, he sounds kind of crazy, but I do play a D and D campaign. Um, my character is like an elf called Alec, and he does have a bow that he's proficient with. So yeah, okay, Braver. Um, let's see what kind of. Character one. Oh. 
They can customize quite a lot of this, so I'm not sure. Let's go for number four, shall we? Let's go for the character creation bit. New yeah, credit character. Yep. Um, Customize face. So for face ten. I'm going to stick with that. Um, oh, what was that? Not sure entirely what that was. So he's fallen off. Um, you know, I don't want any makeup. Let's go hairstyle. What have we got? For that for now. No colour. Okay. Next blonde, go for that. Go back, cut my body. Yeah, let's go for that. Yeah, it's skin color, color is fine, no body paint. Alright, let's choose some outfits. Those are pretty cool. Um, what else we got? Now it's a bit too bells and whistles. None of those tassy bits.
That's a bit weird. Yeah, let's go with this one. Not the colour. That's pretty cool. Let's just take that one, I think. Accessories. What have we got? More headphones. Well, look at that, that's pretty cool. I do like all the customization options you do have. I think they're pretty cool. Um, Spec voice. Let's go for that one. Okay. Um. Yeah, like I said, I've played this briefly. Uh, I'm just getting used to the game, but um. But one of my friends did say he's on a different ship to what I was allocated, so I'm going to Well um... Yeah, so now we're going to let Alec loose on Fantastar 9 too. Yeah, I think she just did the um, character customization. So. Yeah, so I literally just created a character yesterday, so I don't really know what's coming up now. Um, this is my friend told me he's on a different ship, so I thought I'd restart. One of the ships you can't move characters between different ships, which are like lobbies basically. Hmm? Oh, cheers. Name's Arthur. Pleased to meet you, mate. Uh, very British. Um, there's Alex in the, Alex in the first. To search the room. It's you I'm talking to. Fates put us together for this mission, <laughs> so let's make the most of it. Teleportation coordinates set. All ARC operatives, proceed with your mission. Guess they're all set. Looks like we've got a nice and easy spot for our first mission, eh, mate? Let's just stay nice and chill. Let's try us in the action. Probably a bit tutorial, I imagine. I love some of the sound effects. I'm a bit nervous to jump into that telepool. 
But hey, orcs are courageous. Let's get okay, well, here we go. Well, that seems to be a really quick load time, actually. Not much to it at all. This is the first area. Forest. It's very much um, like the first area in Fenster uh, Online 1 on the Dreamcast, which is cool. The whole area is covered top to bottom in nothing but green. Really gets the old blood pumping. <laughs> now hold on. Oh, let's not get too eager too quickly. <sighs> Ah, oh, that's right. This is our first taste of actual combat in the field. I guess we ought to practice the basics first then. But yeah, tutorial. Let's see exactly what they've got for us in the tutorial. I am Hilda, the operator. I will give you your certification mission. First, I will check your vision. Take a look around you. Yeah, it's looking around. He's using the R stick. Good. You didn't seem to have any trouble. Next, I will confirm cool. your maneuverability. Move to the specified location. Okay. Looks like you have no problem with movement. Next, I will confirm how you jump. You see those blocks in front of you? Jump over them. Is A button to jump? Yeah, A is jump. Cool. We can get over a barrier like this. There you go. Good. Okay. Now I'll confirm how you attack. Okay. Teleporting a virtual Combat. target. Cool. Use your equipped weapon to attack it. Okay. Let's kick some ass. Next, I'll confirm your photon arts. Teleporting virtual targets. Photon arts, okay. Uh, switch to the back pallet with the old trigger. Okay. Well then, That's cool. let's continue by confirming your perfect attack. Destroy the virtual target. A perfect attack. You'll pack way more of a punch than you. I'm not sure how, how the perfect attack works. I know it's quite a little bit. effective. So be aggressive with your attacks. Good. Now don't forget Ooh, that. Oh, put down two trees as well. Now it's time to commence your practical training. Proceed. Practical training. Oh, joys. Oh, is that a Sylvan? It sure seems like a handful, but... Uh, I don't get the feeling it wants to be friends. Mate, it looks like we're in for a ball. Oh. Let's go. Enemy suppression confirmed. You did well. Proceed. Well, like it's bow combat.
I can even try to do the environments more. Like the more the environments um, get damaged by attacks and stuff like that. I really like how this looks. While we're at it, let's confirm how you heal. If your okay. HP reaches zero, you will be incapacitated. Don't forget to heal ASAP. Okay, this completes the certification mission. Proceed to the end. Okay, end of the prologue. Oh. Of course, there will be something else trying in. Emergency! Code! Due! Your objective is to suppress the rock bear. Utilize the skills you've honed to suppress it. Read the enemy's movements and strike its weak point. You'll see an opening after it performs a large attack. Aim for it. Wait, we're going to fight that huge thing all of a sudden? Mate, I'll provide backup. You take the lead. That's cool. This is a move. The rock bear's weak point is its head. Watch its movements closely and attack its head after it performs a large attack. We just need to dodge these attacks. Then we can hit it while it's down. So keep dodging, mate! Yeah. Boom! Completed! That's pretty cool. Nice. Time to make for the collection point so you can come back. Head toward the next area. What's a mana mate? Mana mate. Yeah, it's very quick loading. Very quick loading. Ugh. Oh, doesn't sound good. What's happening? Calm down, Alfin. Emergency message from General Control to all Arcs operatives. Okay, so battle incoming. Dangerous photon levels detected. I repeat, a code F order has been issued for Nevarius. Spatial corruption has been detected. Hey, okay. You seeing this, mate? Yes, mate. Seeing it all. Oh, fun times. This lord just appeared out of thin air. False spawn present confirmed. They're exceeding the tolerable limit. Be advised, all parks operate. This is a top priority order. Neutralize. Okay, here we go. Are these wankers real false spawn? The evil thing's trying to consume. Oh, that's his rare words. Wankers, okay, fair enough. Why are they showing up here of all places? There shouldn't be any on the various. Okay, stop so saying up where I shouldn't be. Man, that was almost too dead on. Gumblade. Good thing I prepared for the worst. Are you here to help us? Who are you? Phew, we're safe. We don't have time to settle down right now, though, because the collection point is just up ahead. 
Let's bust through these things. Oh, wait a sec. Are we fighting these things too? That's what you signed up for when you joined Arcs, isn't it? Your friend there looks ready and raring to go. What's your excuse? Yeah, what's that? Come on, mate. Fine. I get it. We don't have a heckin' choice in it one way or another, huh? You're certainly calm for your first rodeo. There's something about you. Hmm? Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to stare. I get the feeling like I've seen you somewhere before. Just can't place where, though. Anyway, think less, act yeah, more. This is gonna be interesting. Let's get the like show some on the road, lore backstory Stick there. with me! Here we go. Next. That's all. Okay, so episode one, chapter zero, the day I was waiting for. Fair enough. Okay. Does your current weapon suit you? You should try various kinds of weapons until you find one you like. Yeah, I like this way. Nice and strong. Can't be music, can't be the urgency to it. Boom. Yeah, I like that. Move the bow. I don't remember there's a bit of a cooldown so the moves after a while. Okay. What's next? Alright, the collection point is just ahead. We have to endure a bit longer. <sighs> Why did this have to happen right after our certification mission? <laughs> that is called Sod's Law, my friend. Oh, wow. Okay. Finally, the night. Oh, oh, come on. That's quite intense. No survivor though. What have we got next? It's got to be another big enemy now. Oh, here we go. I should have lost. Okay. Possibly defeat 
that huge one? Zeno, I'm going to get the return teleport ready. So go take care of that huge Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, come on. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I'll clear them out with a photon blast. Buy me some time, rookies. Oh wow. Okay, so that's a big body down. Ooh. Let's make sure we're still recording, that's all good. Oh, another one, really? Yeah, not bad. You held your own. I'm all set here, so let's keep pressing on. Okay, she's you say a horse has to move. Okay, so mag uniform, uniform maybe. No mag art sort of thing in Brandstar Online 1. Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit. Blast. Yep, definitely swear words. I did in just a split second. Cool. All thanks to you two standing firm. Appreciate the help. Surrounding area secured. We're sending in a telepipe now, so come on. Cool, so I'm about to head back. <laughs> okay. Okay, so monies, monies, monies. I don't think there's anything else of interest around here. Yeah, it's time. I love these car tunnels on the original Fantasy Star. I can't say they're so short in this. Welcome back, everyone. I'm glad you made it back in one piece. Everyone okay? No injuries? Hey, come on. They had me watching out for him. <laughs> you think I'd let something happen? Now, for proper introductions. I'm Zeno. Yeah. The one who never shuts up is Echo. <laughs> Pleasure meeting the two of you. Also, do me a favor and ignore everything he says. Fair enough. Oh, cheers. The name's often. Pleasure's all ours, love. And this here's my new mate. <laughs> You mate. We're pretty fresh out of training and barely start learning what's what in Ox, so <laughs> don't sweat the details, kid. Let the higher ups worry about it. Or get stuck figuring it out for yourself. Those things back there, false spawn, they're pretty much Ark's Ooh, enemy cool. number one. That's about all I can tell you. You're saying some backstory. Kind of lucky you had to face the hard truth about life in Ark's right away. Keeps you from holding on to any illusions at least. 
Have a little sympathy, Zeno. <laughs> These kids just got thrust into the middle of a battlefield. They must be shocked. <laughs> well, sitting around dwelling on it won't make us not at war with the false bond. The sooner you rip off that bandage, the longer you can survive. <laughs> well, I was on a plan, that guy is. Oh, come on. Don't scare him. You both made it back in one piece, right? <laughs> Certification mission completed. That's cause to celebrate. Mm. Yeah. Attaboy often. Even if nothing makes sense, long as you have the willpower to grit your teeth and nod, you'll do just fine. <laughs> that pain, that frustration you feel, never forget it. And never give up. If you can handle that, you'll manage. That's fun. Zeno's got away with words, doesn't he? Until you realize he stole them all wholesale from someone else. Thanks, Echo. Just blow everything wide open, why don't you? Anyway, my mentor's wisdom is my wisdom. Fair enough. Nice saying. Did you come up with it yourself? And besides, you always do whatever you want, never giving a thought to all my hard work. Yeah? Is it my fault you're always late? Stuff it, Zeno! Look, we're finally arriving at the Ark ship! Quit standing there snickering and help with the preparations, rookie! <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, so that's the end of the prologue. Fair enough. Ooh, 100%. That's right, that's pretty cool. Awesome. Okay, cool. Okay, we're going to leave this here, guys. Um, if you want to see me play some more Fantasy Online too, please let me know. I uh, will... Um, do some more. Do find the catch pretty cool. The combat's pretty cool as well. I can see myself spending quite a lot of time on this, so yeah. Please let me know what your thoughts on Fantasy Star 9 2 are. If there's any hints or tips you think I could do with, or anything you want to see in it, please let me know. Um, you know, please like, please uh, pl please like the video, we will try and get these videos out here a bit more. Um, please comment what you think, and please subscribe, like, so close to 100 subscribers at the moment. Um, the, the Series S and X unboxing video kind of really pushed up interest in the channel, which is really great to see, and I'd love to see, I'd love to try and do some more stuff for you guys. Um, I'd love to hit 100 subscribers, so, yeah. We're going to leave that there for now, guys. Thanks for tuning in, and to the next video, see you soon. Thank you.